Who's this lurking in the bushes? Number one, make it so. I like the positive mental yeah. attitude that's coming out of this. We're here today in Simmons Yat with Gav and Gez, Boys in the Wood, and behind them Amy and Paul. And we're having a little walk around, a bit of a tour, repaying the Dorset adventure from a few weeks ago, walking through the villages around the pubs and hotels and things. It's been great. And we're just sort of trying to pick up the path now, which is going to lead us off towards some caves. We're also going to try and show you some other interesting sites uh, and bits along the way as well. Sadly, Kat cannot be with us today, but rest assured we will return to give Simmons Yacht the full teen Valhalla treatment in the near future. I, okay, I like the positive mental yeah. attitude that's coming out of this. Yeah, Gez was just saying this is all old quarries, this area here. You can see by the shape and the sculpt of the rocks. Oh, it's lovely. All the trees and the wildlife kind of reclaimed it now. So you're just heading up towards the caves at the moment through this wonderful corridor of trees. Feeling very autumnal. The colours and things are starting to change. But you can see it over on the side of the river. King Arthur's cave nestled in the beautiful Lord's Wood. The limestone chambers show evidence of human occupation via flint tools and mammoth bones dating back at least 50,000 years to the late Stone Age. How's he finding it, Paul? It's good. Uh, I wish I was a little bit shorter for once in my life. Gez and Gav are going to camp here tonight. What an incredible location. Give that video a little look out over on their channel. Put all the links down in the description, as we'll do with all the details for today's walk as well. Although Kat's not here in body, she is in spirit. So we just stopped for a little tea break and a sandwich um, after our caving, which is fantastic. And I think the guys have just said we kind of head off in this direction next. Pick up the path again, and then we're heading off. Uh, further into Simmons Jazz. So we're just going to climb up out of the, the valley. Yeah, we're just going to follow Gav that way, up out, back onto the footpath. Where are we heading next, guys? Uh, down through the woods and make our way back down to the River Wye. Okay. And we're going to visit Biblin's Suspension Bridge. Quite used to cats spinning me around and making me try to sort of fall over. I think Gez has got a different mission statement today. I think he's trying to wedge me between rock. This is how Kerry was birthed. This is... Poor mother. 
the little idiot. Take it back. <laughs> he wants to go back in. Rucksack, hold on. So the cliffside's just giving birth to Terry. Cheers, <laughs> mate. He was at least graceful. He <laughs> figured it out. Thanks. Yes, you made it. Oh, wow. Look at this. Beautiful oh. views back down over the, the river. Why? Look at that. and that's all people kayaking, canoeing. Just trying to pick up the path, trying to lead our way back down at the moment. All paths lead somewhere, right guys? So we made it down out of the woods, picked up the footpath alongside the River Y, and we're now heading down <laughs> towards the bridge. There was never any doubt, was there? No! There was never any doubt. heading over Bibling's suspension bridge. Limited, I think six people across at a time. We're heading to Yat Rock, which is about one and a half miles away. Just going over the bridge now. It's a bit bouncy, pretty cool. Fantastic. The bridge was pretty cool, wasn't it? Recommend that to anyone. Yeah, so nice. And really they, they cool. replaced all the wood after it got um, pretty much wiped out when the floods came. Yeah, Gez was saying that at certain points of like extreme weathers and, and flooding, the water's actually come up over the bridge. Yeah, literally above the bridge. Wow. Uh, so the guys have just learnt from Paul that the film Psycho was the first film to feature a flushing toilet. Yeah. There we go. Film facts. Stunning walk, guys. Really Thank lovely. Uh, I think we come at the right time of year as well Thanks with the fall, just yeah. the colours. And I mean, don't get me wrong, it's nice all year round, but it's a bit quiet. It's such a good day, I think, where it's like weather. It is, yeah. Really good, it? Hashtag follow the fox. <laughs> We're veering off the path, I'll, I'll heading up back. into the woods. So we're still on our way to Yat Rock. We've just come through this area behind us of parking, a little information centre, toilets, and uh, somewhere I think you can grab a cup of tea. Very busy, very popular spot, lots of cars and lots of people. There's various little viewpoints around the area as well. So I'm just gonna try and sneak over and give you a little peek over the edge. And then somewhere over into the woods there would have been the, the caves and other areas we explored this morning. Popular little area, lots of people over at the cafe and obviously up at the rock. We've now got the walkway to ourselves, which is nice. Yeah, an important area for geology and nature. Obviously falcons and birds of prey love this kind of uh, habitat. And here we are, let's have a look.
So we're just leaving Yat Rock now. We're off in pursuit of a um, famous house from the Netflix series Sex Education. One of the main houses used uh, for Otis and Otis's mum is actually here in Simmons Yat. I'm going to take you to have a look at that next. I guess I was just saying this section of the River Wye down here is the sort of the white water kind of. Yeah, one of two that I know of, there's another one up near here on Wye, but they're both just class one rapids. Class one but rapids. Good fun to have a go on. Yeah? Yeah, good fun to have a go on. And Amy actually spotted the house, the sex education house. So we're just taking a little detour now before we head back towards the cars. We're about six miles, I think, into today's walk. And it's been absolutely brilliant, breathtaking. So this is the, the house they use in sex education. The main characters, uh, Otis and his family. It is also available, I think, to hire as a Airbnb. Oh, it's all gated off, look. They knew we were coming. So we're just coming back yeah, over the suspension bridge now. <laughs> They're all wobbling it behind me. Very safe. I'm just keeping up a good pace. So we've not long come over the bridge. I think we're somewhere around the eight mile mark for today's walk. So we've had an absolutely great day, Sim and Jap. Thanks to Boys in the Wood for guiding us around. They're off now for their wild camp. So make sure that you check out that video. That again, links will be down in the description. Foxy, Amy, thanks guys. Uh, and again, if you've enjoyed the video, enjoyed what you've seen today, don't forget to smash that thumbs up. Drop a little comment down below. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so that you're notified for future videos when they go up. And until next time, stay safe and well. And keep enjoying those green spaces.